Are there any other areas, any other kind of key areas that you think parents need to know about for teens just regarding banking or financial activities? You've covered a lot, but just want to make sure we've covered every uh, potential aspect here. Yeah, I pulled up a couple in the curriculum that we teach kids about that I'll oh, just great. Yeah. kind of extrapolate here if that's okay. But two sure. of the big ones that um, are targeted at teens right now, online shopping scams. This is mm -hmm. when a scammer creates an online ad or store that claim to sell cheap designer goods, electronic gadgets, and other popular items. Sometimes they product they offer or imitations, and after paying for them, consumers may not get what they hope for or may not get anything at all. So that's something that teens are falling for. They see a little yeah. thing on Instagram shop here, and it looks awesome, and it's yeah. not really what they were hoping for, and then they don't, you know, what do they do? And the other right. one are these online influencer scams. Teens love influencers. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of them online. Sometimes a scammer creates a fake social media account that looks like that of an influencer or celebrity. They might even stage an online contest and ask the winner to pay a fee or to provide their bank account number in order to get their prize. Mm -hmm. So that's something else that's happening. So, you know, for kids to be aware, you never give your bank account information online. I mean, you just, you just yeah. don't do it. So, you know, it's, they make these things easy and fun and, you know, enticing and just for kids to be taught like, Hey, warning, 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 don't do this. 